Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're here today in Grosvale, backing onto the Blue Mountains National Park in one of the most peaceful settings that you could possibly imagine. And it was here that our owners chose to embark on a labour of unbridled ambition, love and tremendous scope. And the resulting property is one of the most incredible opportunities to have come to market in the district. Welcome to 30A Weem Farm Road, right here in Grosvale. The home is positioned on a prized 10 acre land holding with complete privacy from every touch point and the property offers four distinct structures being the main home which is an 84 square, six bedroom, four bathroom residence with double car garage and in addition to this we have three large sheds which we'll come to shortly. The floor plan of the home is both vast and yet intuitive and unfolds across three distinct wings. We have an entry foyer with an adjacent study office area situated to the right of the main kitchen, dining and living areas. We then have another segregated wing for the parents retreat and master suite with walk in his hers robes and ensuite. To the other end of the home we have a third wing which boasts three downstairs bedrooms plus a study serviced by two bathrooms and all centralising around the rumpus room. And from here, we have an upstairs studio gallery, which sides on to two further upstairs bedrooms. From the moment you approach the grand entry foyer with its blue gum timber lining boards and high pitched roof and the bold Jarra front door, you know you're about to see something really special. And everywhere you look, your eye is drawn in from the stunning landscape surrounding the home to the equally stunning design characteristics that embody the property. Now the heart of the home is the central kitchen living area, which features this stunning 3.72 meter high pitched ceiling with lineal ducted air vents. And here, the merging of indoor outdoor spaces is seamless with two quad door sliding panels and French doors opening out to the surrounding patio and alfresco space and the prevalent use of these 3.3 meter high glass panels brings in the view and floods the room with natural light. Framing the chef's kitchen is this enormous 3 meter island bench with 40 mil stone, waterfall ends and cabinetry to the front of the island. We also have 40 mil stone to the secondary benched areas which house dual stainless steel sinks and a zip boiler. We then have a suite of stainless steel appliances starting with a Miele dishwasher, 900 millimeter induction cooktop and electric oven, microwave with trim kit, 900 mil range hood and a clean made steam oven. There is also an abundance of white polyurethane soft closing cabinet space on offer and a home of this calibre we of course have the full butler's pantry accessible through a concealed sliding door with dual stainless steel sinks set behind a glass splashback window and further 40 mil stone benches and plenty of additional storage. The entirety is finished with the chic hanging pendant lights above the island and the bifold servery window to the alfresco. Moving further, and one of my favourite details within the home are these sandstone walls and columns that feature in the rumpus room, living area and parents retreat and two of them even house combustion low-pi fireplaces set within the sandstone. The parents retreat is also another distinct space that looks like it has been plucked straight out of a resort in the Hunter Valley with its massive high raked ceilings and custom walnut joinery with 220 bottle wine storage and clever inset display lighting and from here opening straight out to the tiled undercover patio. Stepping back inside and the bathrooms throughout the home are incredibly opulent from the stone top vanities with LED backlighting to the freestanding 80 millimeter marble bathtubs imported from Bath we have a suite of other inclusions throughout such as waterfall shower heads with secondary heads, floor to ceiling tiles, dual sinks to the master suite, frameless mirror panels, a combination of chrome and matte black tapware and a feature wall made of sterling silver glass. Another unique attribute of the home is the lighting throughout and worthy of note are the recessed down lights and wall lighting from Saudi Arabia, the navigator lighting for the kids and these incredible blade lights that feature in various rooms throughout the home. The games room is an awesome platform to entertain guests and is set under a soaring 4.3 meter high rake ceiling with a coffer TV cavity, sandstone wet bar with granite bench top, LED backlit shelving and the adjacent understair cupboard conveniently houses the Foxtel boxes and controls to the sound system which is set into the ceiling of the games room and alfresco areas. The games room opens out to the first of three alfresco areas and from here it's straight out to a nine meter sweet water pool and secondary splash pool. The pool has four LED lights which are stunning of an evening and the entirety is surrounded by glass panel balustrade and sandstone retaining beds. To the other end of the lawn area we also have a second alfresco space which flows on from the kitchen and then a third dedicated alfresco which serves as a barbecue area with a stainless steel prep area either side of the barbecue. Now it's time to talk shedding and this property is enormously practical for those with multiple vehicles or machinery. There are three sheds at your disposal. The first is adjacent the house and is 10 meters by 17 meters with three phase power, a bathroom, a kitchenette. To the front of the shed we have a shade sail big enough to cover two large vehicles and this shed offers fully insulated walls and roof, eight double power points, 
two air conditioners, its own 22,000 litre water tank, roof sprinklers, solar panels, and a convenient side roller door leading to a further external parking bay. If that wasn't enough, it also has a combustion fireplace, a bedroom, TV connection, Wi-Fi, a generator with a meter board sufficient to run the entire property, and behind the shed, a rear driveway which wraps around and leads straight down to the other two sheds. The second shed is nine meters by eight meters, and the third shed is seven meters by 16 meters with two three-phase power outlets. Further features of this home include roller blinds throughout, custom fitted joinery to the his, hers robes with built-in robes to all secondary bedrooms, two dams with a water pump to the main dam which services the gardens and connecting to eight garden taps in total, steel mounted mezzanine storage to the double car garage, cat five and six cable throughout the entire residence, all double glazed window and door fittings and all aluminum, easement access to Little Weenie Creek and an easement to the creek for pumping water, the roof and all internal external walls are fully insulated, ducted vacuum system, the house features three completely separate and independent Fujitsu three phase reverse cycle air conditioning systems for the three distinct wings, 105,000 litre concealed water tank to the main home, four Wi-Fi boosters with 120 metre radius, stainless steel automatic lights running the entire length of the driveway to see you in, remote open close function to the upper window panels in the main kitchen dining area, quad linen press with additional overhead storage, internal external keypad to the front gate with a video intercom system feeding to the kitchen, two solar inverters feeding from a 39 panel solar system with mounted panels to the house and shed with an optimized 30 degree angle to ensure peak generation, auto doors with remote to the double car garage and remote controlled front gates, and solar hot water. Well, thank you so much for joining me for a closer look at 30A Weem Farm Road right here in Grossvale and what a property it is. So on behalf of myself and the team here at Guardian Realty, Tina Dwight and the team at LJ Hooker Richmond, thank you for watching and we look forward to seeing you soon.